How's it going everybody? Driver53 here and today we are going to go over something very interesting about this mulcher right here. I've been doing some testing. As you can see, I've got a nice strip of land here that we've been doing a ton of soil testing on to try and figure out exactly what the best process is for getting the absolute best yield that you can. And I stumbled across something here that I really feel like you guys need to know about and I want to go ahead and get a quick video out here to go ahead and show you. And if you want to stay up to date on that video or any of the other videos that I have coming out here for Farming Simulator 22, make sure you hit that subscribe button and the notification bell. That way you're notified every time I have a new release. We're doing quite a few how-to videos here for Farming Simulator 22 and I'm really excited. We're getting in, we're digging and I just can't wait to share all this information with you guys. Let me take you over here to another piece of equipment. And yes, it is the John Deere 1775NT. This is the direct drill. Well, a direct planter is what it is. And we're doing some testing to see exactly what process you need to use. And something very, very interesting happened. I've already mentioned it, and you guys can look at the ground right here. It's a very uneven texture. And I don't know exactly what's going on with it, but I do know what results I got when I did some yield studies. So let me go ahead and show you this data right here. As you can see, I've planted corn, canola, and sunflowers. And we did a direct drill only using the John Deere right here. And for the yields, I got 175% when I did just the direct drill. So then I was like, well, we've been told that mulching is important to the game. That's why they put them in here. So I wanted to run the mulcher first and then the direct drill. But as you can see, my yields went down to, you know, about 172 point something. So between 172.3 and 172.6. So this right here proves that you do not need a mulcher whenever you're going to direct drill. Now, these are the only three crops that I've tested it on, but I don't see why it would be any different from everything else. If you guys are seeing any different results, put it down in the comments below. Let me know what crop you're running and what your difference was on your yield, because I've run this test two different times and both times I got the exact same results. I didn't believe it the first time, so I ran it again. And then I did that on canola and I did it on sunflower also. So I've run this test six times on three different crops. And this is the results that I got every single time. Now, I don't think that mulching itself is bad because I've seen some other results on some other tests that I've done that prove that the mulcher actually helps, but I don't think with the direct drill it does. So if you want to stay up to date on the video that I'm going to be putting out going over the exact process that you need to use for planting or seeding, consider hitting that subscribe button. And if you do, hit the notification bell too. Have a great day, night, evening, everybody. Until next time, this is Driver53 signing off.